Boardwalk Empire star Gretchen Mull is lighting up the off-Broadway stage in The Good Mother, a chilling new play by Francine Volpe. We're going behind the scenes with Mull and the cast at the Acorn Theater. For people that may not have seen the play yet, what is The Good Mother all about? The Good Mother is about a young woman. Um, her name is Larissa, and she, like many of us, uh, is doing the best she can given the current economic situation. And she asks um, a teenager uh, to come and babysit her young daughter. And we come to learn that the teenager is the son of her former counselor. She meets a guy, a trucker, played by me, and during their first date, a little bit of a strange thing happens in the house and a few things get kick-started and we see through how she deals with the with this event we see a lot about how she relates to other people. I'm always still discovering new things and the other day it occurred to me that it was all about this woman who is really com coming to terms with childhood events you know this this psychologist that she new as a 12 year old girl through her teen years and all these kind of unresolved issues and now in the course of you know Thanksgiving weekend she's kind of uh, going back and sort of facing some things and raising questions. It's a thinker. It makes your audience think. There's a lot of interesting silences. A lot of things are left in the open purposely. Um, Francine our um, playwright did a brilliant job at really making it a piece of what an individual audience member will interpret. The show has a lot of characters that have a lot of different points of view and who can I trust in this play? <laughs> I think every character would tell you that, that, that you can trust them and that's uh, sort of the joy of the play too is that um, uh, Francine has drawn these very uh, richly dynamic characters and um, they're very human and they have many, many sides and you can see their foibles as well as, you know, their uh, good qualities. And this isn't the first time that, you know, especially screen audiences have seen you play a broken mother, but what drew you to this, you know, this mother in particular? I think it was just the play. I mean, it was such a huge challenge. I've never had this amount of pressure, really, to kind of, uh, you know, be able to to go from A to B to C all the way to Z at the end of the play. And it's kind of, uh, it's just a tremendous opportunity for an actress. Francine has written this role that I think for years to come, actresses will go to. For me, it was a page turner. And that's what I really liked about it. I found it sort of psychologically complex and at the same time a page turner, which is, in my opinion, hard to do, uh, especially for somebody as jaded as me. So I, uh, so it hit me in the gut. You know, the story hit me in the gut and the page turner element excited me, uh, just as a director, as an artist, to sort of see if I could create something like that on the stage that sort of felt like a page turner. What's the audience reaction been like so far when you've been out there? Have you heard any? Yeah, I mean, there are some gasps in the audience at certain times in the play which are always fun to to experience because that means they're kind of with us. It's been fun to sort of watching people leaning forward. You know, there's that lean forward thing, which uh, is gratifying for something like this. It means they're listening and they're wrapped. It's not your typical, typical show, I would say. It, it really makes you think and it makes you engage and it makes you a part of the theater. You cannot just come and expect it's not going to be you know spider-man people aren't pyrotechnics nobody's gonna tell you how to feel with this one um i think it's so for that it's it's a great experience